Hey guys, Classic here, and welcome back to Let's Play with Buffy the Vampire Slayer Chaos Bleed. Today we are doing the cemetery, so after this loads, we're going to enter a cutscene. Yay! <laughs> here we go. Long time no see, Slayer. How's tricks? Sid? The one and only. I know, I know, you haven't been the same since I left. The ladies love the wood. Lovely. You're still a class act. What are you doing here, Sid? I thought when your demon hunting days were over, your soul had left that dummy body behind. Moved on to the old proverbial better place? Been there, done that, babe. And now I'm back. You're not the only one. I know. Kakistos. Wait, how? No time for punchlines, sweetheart. If you're looking to go after Kakistos, he went that away. Fine. But I want to know what's going on around here. We're gonna have a talk later, you and me. Okay, so welcome to the cemetery. Um, lovely place to be. Um, uh, yeah, and this is actually one of the levels in Buffy, uh, where there's like loads and loads of enemies. Um, there is another level, uh, which is later on. Uh, what have you Ah, the Sunnydale Zoo, it's like the second to last level, I believe. Uh, that has a lot of uh, um, enemies in, it can be very annoying. But, uh, oh god, he casually does his own teammate there. Oh, he's coming, he's coming, block. You bitch, die. Oh yeah, right, let's grab, grab this spade. Grab it. Oh, uh, Buffy, Buffy! Oh, yeah. I hate that move so much. It's so annoying. They just don't like move forward. They just stay in one position, then you get Those hit. Dead guys. They're so fragile. Okay, I wanna say, uh, in this game there happen. are so many locked doors and you kind of have to check them all because um, some actually do open. Um, but you're gonna get really annoyed. Oh fuck! Where the fuck did you come from? You bastard. No. Yeah, as I was saying before I was really interrupted, um, you're gonna get very annoyed with all the little catchphrases all the characters say. Little pigs, little pigs. Like that one. Ah, never mind. I'll find another Because one. there are just so many. Um, if I remember, then there shouldn't be that many locked doors, but obviously I can't remember every single level and what doors are actually open and what are locked. This one's obviously open because you can see inside it. Um sundial piece. Just what I was looking for. Um, uh, this dead piece of poo is gonna come alive. <gasps> Battering with a spade. <laughs> um, and the crypt door is kind of like locked now, so you have to like uh, grab onto this and like push this forward on this like pressure plate here. There we go. And it unlocks the door. Yeah, there's a lot of puzzles in this game, and some are so confusing. Some kids um, have a blankie as oh a god. object. The most Lucky confusing level is work. probably the Sunnydale, uh, no, the high school. That's probably the most confusing level. Uh, but you'll see why. Like right, I'm to. running past this bitch. Um, yeah, let's see, there's a lot of breakable items as well. Uh, so, some areas you have to kind of break into, maybe, or find a different way around. Oh god. Um, you will not be seeing me use Hellfire or Holy Water because it's a load of shit and it will kill you more than actually save you. So I'm not even gonna bother. Ooh, finally. Oh. See, I hate when she does that because you can't block with a spade either. It's very annoying. Fuck off. Mistake him. Oh my god. Bitch, please, let me alone. Oh my god, she banged her head on the tree. <laughs> god. Oh, run away from you. Um, which door? Is this open? Yeah, it is. Ah! Go away! What do we have? This is another secret. Um, Time for some uh, yeah, everything else. Oh! God! 
A lot of enemies sneak up on you in this game. It's so annoying. Because you just get, like, attacked. Oh, what happened to my spade? <gasps> Those dead guys. Oh, it, it turned, so like, fragile. broke. Okay. Yeah, your weapons do have duration. It's the purple bar at the bottom. It's the health. Um, spades and battle axes turn to, like, giant stakes. But I don't use them because they're a bit annoying. I'd rather use my normal stakes, as I said in the first episode. Um, also, how do you like the new thumbnails and, uh... There's no lock. Must be some other yeah. way to open this. Sundial piece one. Okay. Um, how do you like the new thumbnails on my videos? I'm going to be doing that for like nearly all of my series. Uh, but yeah, oh god, I'm going to have to fight these bastards. Um, yeah. Um, I'm currently editing the first uh, episode right now. Um, well, I had to to do my thumbnails without being partnered. You have to put like a really long. You get your picture that you want as a thumbnail and you have to put it at the end of the video for like a really long time, like half the time of the video. So now I've just like cut that bit out. Um, and now it's just like rendering and then, well not rendering, but like editing it properly. And then once that's finished, I'll put that up as public so everyone can see it. But at the moment only me and people I send the link to can send it, it's in private. So yeah, because it's a 15 minute long video, but you don't want like the last 15 minutes. It's half hour long all, but half that time is just a picture uh, to make it come available as a thumbnail. So you don't really want to watch 15 minutes of just a picture. So obviously it's going to be going to be cut out because you can actually cut out stuff in your videos just on YouTube. So that's how you do thumbnails. Uh, three pieces there, Weird and the door opens in the graveyard behind. It's uh, yeah, out here. So yeah, um, I had college today and I kind of been creeping people out. Why? Go away! I hate when they go on the floor, it's so frustrating. So annoying. Uh, yeah, I had college today and I'd be like really creeping they people out. So I don't think I have any friends to. now, because I've been just scared of everyone. Oh my god, wow. Church key. Okay. Uh, back over here. Yeah, there's kind of a lot of backtracking in this game as well, so if I don't have any, anything to talk about, that could be a problem, because it's kind of a backtracky game. It kind of is, yeah. Mm. Oh, quick buff, you go. Oh god, is it following me? No, it's not. I don't think they can open doors. I think vampires can, I don't think zombies can, though. No, they can't, okay. Um, let's have a look around. Oh, the vampires, okay. Well, hello there. How are you, kid? Oh, bitch. Oh, damn. Damn, girl. Die. Ah. <laughs> you can just hit me button mashing. Like, hardcore. Oh, this one behind me. Oh. And that's all she wrote. Come on, bitch. I actually love combat in this game. Um, some of my favorite boss fights are when you just completely, like, just beat the shit out of the bosses. They're probably my favourite boss fights. Um, you can do the flying kick as well, but they're not really useful. I don't really do that much. I kind of only stick to kicks as well. Kicks are probably my favourite things to do. Don't really use punches much. Kind of using them more in the LP though. Oh wow, I forgot about that. That's actually the first time. Okay. Oh, okay. Not much for cutscene. Um, you can actually throw enemies and um, you can throw them onto like wooden objects like this and they get automatically stayed. But obviously I didn't throw them, it kind of, the vampire kind of fell on it. Uh, but that's actually the first time I've used the environment to my advantage, which is kind of cool. Probably won't be ever doing that ever again. Oh, bitch. I don't know how I'm doing them like flying kick things, so I have no idea. I don't know half the, com the combat on this game. I just do the standard punches and kicks and they kind of work, so that's all I really stick to. Uh, vampire here. Oh, gee, oh god. Yeah, you can throw vampires as well, but I don't really know how to do it, so I don't really bother. Oh, stop buffing. Stop doing the flying kicks. You always miss. You really suck. Yeah, see, both stakes just broke. You can hold a maximum of five stakes. Oh, uh, uh, spiders. I knew that was coming. So these are probably the most annoying enemy in the game. Yeah, they probably are. Uh, which way are we going? You can break through weak... Oh, God. You can break through weak doors. Like, 
that. Well, a minute ago, like that. I say stuff so late in my LP, seriously. Oh, God. Ah, it's puking on me. Ace it! Die. Come on! These these are annoying enemies as well, because they just fall to the floor and you have to, like, stomp on them. Secret? No. Just stakes. Uh. I do like part of these, like, little catchphrasey funny thingies. Hers are quite funny. Oh, ah! 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 Do you see what I mean by so many enemies in this level? There are so many. This is actually quite a long level. Um, you wouldn't think for a game like this um, that the levels would be long. But the levels are about 40-50 minutes long. Uh, the high school actually takes me about an hour to do because it is just so difficult and confusing. So I prepared for a long video in that section. Well, in that level. Get beat up, bitch. Uh, up this side, I think, like, crypt thingy, um, is actually a medikit and a bottle of holy water. And it's a secret. Um, and here? over this side is where you actually have to go. Um, do you know what would have really been awesome on this game? If, if you could actually, like, change costumes, um, or the game did it for you, but... Buffy has one costume. Well, every character in this game ha only has one costume, and they have it for like the entire game. So it's a bit unfortunate, but it would have been. Oh, okay. This is actually a werewolf. If I kill this guy, if I kill the zombies first, then I can show you. Okay, this is actually a werewolf, and these are uh, like vampires. They're a bit stronger, and they do need staking. Uh, but they don't, they don't poof into dust, they kind of just like, go green. Oh, a sword, I don't know whether to use a sword what or not. Yeah, I'll use it, why not? Um, oh, werewolf. Why is there a werewolf in the sewer? That's a good question, actually. Oh, there's another one coming. Ah, Buffy. Bam. Come on, bitch. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. Oh my god. This, this is why. That's a, oh, there's a zombie there as well. That's another reason why weapons are annoying because of the long finishing. So I think I might stick to my stakes because they're fast and efficient. Is that the right word? Efficient. They get the job done quick. Yeah. Um, down there was just like stakes. They do kind of spam you with stakes. A bit too much probably. Um, they could have made this. Um, game more difficult if they like didn't really put many stakes in. Um, here is like a little knobbly bit. Some exactly. Kind of the handle's missing, so we need but to find the, the valve handle. Missing. God, I think Buffy, Buffy kind of explained that better than why I did. Knobbly bit. Oh god, it sounds so dirty. Oh, more werewolves. This is actually like a zombie werewolf or something. There are actually like loads and loads of enemies in this game. Uh, yeah, there are a big variety of enemies. And the valve handle is actually in this box. Um, kind of surprising and probably... You probably wouldn't look there. Um, you'd probably look like run around for like ages. Oh god, there's another one. What the hell? Oh! Acid! Yeah, you probably wouldn't look in the boxes unless you need like stakes and stuff. But uh, this is what I mean by this game gets challenging. Like, you really have to think outside the box. And I was speaking to someone, that just shows me that the valve's going, um, the steam's turned off. I was speaking to someone in the comments when I announced that I was going to do this game. Um, and they were saying to me that they found this game difficult as well. It may not look difficult at this point, but when we get into the later levels, anyone could, will tell you that this game does get pretty tricky and pretty challenging. Because you really do need to think outside of the box. Um, I probably have not played a game like this before. Um, it's a very unique game and I love it. I really do. I knew you were coming, bitch. No jump scare there. Oh, fuck off! Spain, you stupid agent on me! Health kit. I'll use one of them. And holy water. I need, brothers, mix and scrapes. I would actually. Bath. I would actually use holy water if it here? wasn't so. 
annoying. Ask and you shall receive. Um, and sometimes but yeah, this is like a break of the wall. Um, holy water and hellfire are so annoying to aim. But if, it, if they were like easier to aim, I would probably actually would use them. Um, yeah, I would probably use them if they weren't so annoying to aim. But uh, there's no like targeting system, which is kind of frustrating. It's just like this. Yeah, so that could be a bit annoying. But uh, I wouldn't really bother picking up Holy Water or Hellfire, to be honest. Another fuse okay, box. I was meant to activate the little this speech thing about the fuse, fuse, fuse box residence. back here. Basically, this fuse box over here is empty. Look, you can see it's missing one. So, yeah. That takes care of the so fuse. now we can actually go but over here life. and uh, use and the bridge controls to get to the other side. On. Trust me, the puzzles may look easy now, but wait till we carry on. Like, you wouldn't even think about some of the puzzles. You're like, wow, I would not even have thought of that. Like, I couldn't even complete this as a child because it was just too difficult and hard. It really was. Um, Werewolf. Th this game likes to do that as well. They like to throw enemies at you, like round corners. They, they like to try and make you jump. Unfortunately, it doesn't work with me because I've played it before. You are but yeah, so they can't. They dead. like to make you jump in no. this game for some random really? reason. Because Buffy's not horror, is it? It's more of sci-fi thriller, maybe. Oh. These uh, these zombies here with like the grey hair—they kind of scare me. They look like old people zombies, um, and they're they're kind of tougher than normal zombies as well. So. Uh, Medic. Yeah. Great. I need some code. I could just find a cute code. doctor. Oh, vampires. How long have you been recording for? This level is very long. Hey there, beautiful. For like the second level in the it's game. Come on, bitch. God's sake, zombie, go away. Yeah, if you notice uh, that kick where she like does like a roundhouse, just move them, then button mash your kick button, and she like do roundhouses because um, if you move, she does like that punch. Um, if you stand still, she like does that punch. If you stand still and kick, she does that kick. So she does different uh, combos, the, if, like the way, the different ways you're like moving and stuff. So yeah, I kind of like to move while doing kicks because they can three combo a zombie and they die. So yeah, that's probably the best way to kill zombies. But these ones, like I said, they're stronger, so you're gonna need to use some punches at the end of them. Oh, or not. Sometimes they die, sometimes they don't, depends how they feel. <laughs> uh, if you come over here, you can see... Yeah. Okay. And I don't see you a handle. do that. Must have some kind of funky lock trigger. And it's if you locked. notice on this the like, little light thing over here, inside. there's like an eagle. There has to be a way in. And there's an eagle right here. That just shows. It's small cutscenes like stuff changing. I'll just skip them because there's no point. Because I'll just tell you what happens. Uh, yeah, there's no point. Okay, we need that ignition key. We can get out of here. I'm not fighting that zombie. I can't be asked. They just give. They just spam you with so many enemies. Um, you'll see me in Sunny. Oh my god, see what I mean? In Sunnydale Mall, you're not Mall. Sorry, in Sunnydale Zoo, you'll see me just run away from like probably all of the enemies in that level because they're just so annoying. Because they do literally spam you with them. Oh god. Camera. Whoa. Um, how now I see why you need a special license nearly. for this kind of thing. We're nearly at the end of the level, actually. See, I'm just going to run past these zombies. Oh. Um, I mean, vampires. Because there's honestly no point. Because I don't have to... Like, I will only fight them if I need to, like, open a door. Because they, they can actually hit me while I'm opening a door. But I need to just come over here and just jump up, so I'm not I'm honestly not even going to bother fighting them. There's just no point. Um, I'll fight these so they, so I can sort the puzzle out. The eternal flame. Ooh, the Buffy, awesome. Gas I wish I knew how to do that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How do, how do I? How do I? I really wanna... How do I, like, do that, like, flying kick thing? 
I, I really want to learn how to like. Actually, let me go to my Slayer Handbook. I just casually healed. Uh, no, not object Slayer Handbook. Um, left, yeah, okay. Spinning right kick. Um. Look at all the combos. There's so many combos in this game. And I don't even use them. Yeah, there are just so many combos. I don't even use them. Uh, what was... The jumping roundhouse kick. Was that it? Yeah, there we go. Jumping roundhouse kick. Woohoo! That's an easy way to kill zombies. I'm just gonna do that for zombies now. Hopefully you'll have the common sense to stay dead this time. Buffy, do it. They just okay, she's just gonna refuse to do that one. <laughs> I actually love that now. I am like... Oh, that's cool as well. You know what? It's Sorry, to be I'm like... They, they, that's like totally new to me. I never look at the Slayer Handbook. Never ever. Um, so that's like completely new to me. So I'm kind of actually pretty Burn, impressed baby. with myself. Um, little puzzle. One torch on one side, one torch on the other. Easy as pie. Cutscene. Kikistos. If it walks like a duck and quacks like a duck. You're not easy to kill, are you, Slayer? I could say the same thing about you. <laughs> oh, I'll have my turn at you eventually. But there's another I've got my eye on. You're just the appetizer. You can keep running, but you know I'm gonna dust your ugly carcass eventually. Yeah. I think I will. And you, Slayer? You can decide what's more important. Catching me, or stopping the spell before it resurrects all oh, of Joyce. in this bone. I love Joyce. Mom! That was so, like, unemotional, it really was. Mom! Yay, yeah, Spike. Okay, I want to explain these orbs. Um... If you look at the orbs, you can see they're quite, the outer rim are shining quite brightly. I'm just evading all these zombies. Um, and then they go a bit dull, and they go a bit see-through. When they go see-through, you can actually damage the orbs. Um, so I'm just going to stay by the orb and wait till it goes see-through. But you see how like the outer rim is like shiny? Uh, you can definitely tell the difference, but when you're running around, because there's a later boss, don't want to spoil it. But um, actually, no, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say it because it will spoil it because it's pretty obvious if I say. Yeah, so I'll show you. Okay, I'm not even gonna bother going up to Spike. He can just like kill them himself. Actually, I'll go help him. He looks quite molested over there. Common sense to stay dead this time. Spinning kick. Oh, okay. Spin, spinning, oh no, Buffy, spinning kick. Buff, Buffy, do your, do as you're told. Oh, she's, she's not behaving. She, why is she not behaving? I don't like you anymore, Buffy. I hate you now. Oh, damn, bro. Woo. Okay, come on, come on. Oh my god. Okay, that completely missed. Right, that's the minute kick can go like F itself, seriously. It will not do it whenever I want it to. Is that ready? No, it's not. There's oh my god! Zombies! Stop going on the floor! It's so frustrating! Okay, is this ready? No, it's not. No, I thought it was. So you see, it's kind of difficult to judge. Uh, this is why I had so much problem with that boss fight. I was talking about. No, it's not ready. Die. 
Okay. You see how it's like see through? You can now punch it. Just don't make color. It goes blue, yellow, like red. Punch it again. I don't know if it's random sometimes. I don't know, maybe it is random. I'm not sure. Punch it again. That was a rude awakening. What's going on around here, Buffy? I don't know, but that's going to Oh my god, change. I just thought. I Whoever's should try to stake Spike and maybe he would die and he'd probably get, give me like a game over. That'd be hilarious. Um, so that was the cemetery. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time for what, the Blood Factory. So, once again, thanks for watching, and have a good day.